This run has been going a lot better than the other run. Seeing how her prince ran away and she had to summon the one in it. Looks like I have the wrong idea. You're no princes! Die, you worthless commoners! Um, I'm sure Angel is Angel is the one that has the. Yosuke scared. Yeah, I know he's gonna put with here. I get it. I have. To. I Thanks. do. I get it. Yeah. He's not really that big of a deal anymore because I um, put all of Chie's things up. Uh, I built her. Uh, I see all the way up before I started this. White wall, huh? That's really how you want to play it. Honestly, not that big of a deal as long as I'm not the one that gets attacked by that. Then it will start being a bigger deal. Sorry. No, thank you. I don't know if the ice resistance is up. He's gone or not. I haven't really counted them any how many turns. Because I'm going Thanks. to run out of SP. And once that happens, um, I'm gonna be back. White wall again, dude. It's cornered. You're nearly there. Oh, my God, you fucking bitch. Scared. 
Resistance is up. I mean, it's not up anymore. It's done. Here's our chance. right now as a healer. Yosuke's level 11, Yoshi's level 11. the only one like that, Yukiko-san. Everyone has something they can't show to other people or don't want to admit to themselves. Yukiko, I'm sorry. I was so self-centered that I never understood what you were going through. I'm your friend. And I still... I'm so sorry. Chie. I was always jealous of you, Yukiko. You had everything that I didn't. That jealousy was like a wall, and I was so lonely. I wanted you to need me. But it was me who needed you. I can't do anything right on my own. I've caused so much trouble for Yosuke and the others. If you weren't by my side, I... I wouldn't know what to do. Chie. I never saw the real you, either. I was too busy trying to find an easy way out. I want to run away. I want someone to save me. You're right. Those feelings are part of me, too. I understand now. You're me. The strength of the heart required to face oneself has been made manifest. That's uh, what? Okay, that's just a lot, dude. Yukiko has faced her other self. She has obtained the facade used to overcome life's hardship. The persona. Konohana Saika. Saki, yeah, whatever. Yukiko. Are you okay? Yes. I'm just a little tired. You all came to rescue me. Of course! Thank you. <laughs> Don't even mention it. I'm just so glad you're safe! <laughs> right on. So, who threw you in here? Huh? Who are you? Rather, what are you? I'm Teddy! So who threw you in? I don't know. 
I think someone called my name, but my memory's a blur. I can't remember who it was. I'm sorry, um, Teddy? No new clues. Not necessarily. Now we know for sure that someone threw Yukiko-san in here. Hmm. Then it really isn't you guys. Are you satisfied now? I always believed it wasn't you guys. You little... You're one lying sack of honey. Anyways, let's hurry back home. Yukiko looks exhausted. Thanks again, Teddy. Uh, wait, you're leaving me here? Leaving you? What are you talking about? You live here. Well, yeah, but... I'm sorry, Teddy. I promise to come again. So be a good boy and wait here until then. Oh, he's simping over here. My, it's getting crowded here. Why don't you and I go somewhere else? Come on, pretty please. Ah, you're giving me the creeps. That's it, you're stuck here for the rest of your life. <laughs> Yukiko, are you all right? You're not hurt anywhere, are you? No, I'm just a little tired. Do you remember anything? I'm sorry, but I don't remember anything. Well, no worries. You're safe, and that's more than enough. But there's no mistake that Yukiko-san was, um, attacked the same way as the last two victims. And I think the one we saw on the Midnight Channel wasn't the real Yukiko-san, but her shadow. Maybe the things Yukiko-san was suppressing in this world took form in the TV. You know, Teddy was saying something like that. <sighs> it's no use. I'm just going round and round in circles. What kind of person could be doing this? Let's give it some thought. Should take time to consider the situation. Wait. Can't we talk more about this some other time? Yukiko really needs to get some rest. I'll take her home. Oh, that's right. Sorry. Yukiko-san must be exhausted. We'll talk about all this some more once she gets her strength back. One day the palace, right then, or dungeon, whatever. So, um, what happened is that after after I finished, after I uh, did the recording yesterday, uh, I forgot to save, so I had to do the entire day again, including the dungeon again. So if things aren't exactly the same how they were before, like um, the personas I have or anything, that's probably why. So yeah, that's it. That's that. Just a little disclaimer, it's not going to be exactly the same. And then I didn't record the entire boss battle because I didn't know how long, how many tries it was going to take me. But it took, I did it first try. So right when I was like, I could probably beat her, I started recording again. So yeah, you're able to rescue Yukiko safely. But this case's mysteries have deepened even further. For now, you should wait for Yukiko to recover. Hi there. We got off work at the same time, so I'm giving him a ride back to his place. I thought we might as well swing by. Nice to meet you. I'm Adachi, the guy who's been your dad's slave since spring. I can still work you harder, you know. <laughs> a good one, sir. <laughs> uh... Oh, I almost forgot. You're friends with Yukiko Amagi, right? They found her safe and sound. Tell all your friends at school. That's a relief. You have to play dumb. Yeah, for us on the force too. But this doesn't mean the case is closed though. We were just questioning Miss Amagi. But she says she doesn't remember anything that happened while she was missing. And we can't figure out her whereabouts during the missing period either. 
It's like she really disappeared. It's all pretty fishy if you ask me. Like there's something else going on. Ow! Stop blabbering, dumbass. <laughs> Sorry. Ignore him. He's just spouting some wild fantasy. Oh, forget it then. Yeah, don't give it a second thought. Sheesh. He's a real pain sometimes. I'm hungry. <laughs> You're right. My stomach's growling too. <laughs> so you do have a softer side around Nanako-chan, sir. Shut up and sit down. And wash those hands first. Hm. I should do the same. Dinner promises to be lively for once. I would love to save my progress this far. That way I don't have to do all that again. Sending data. Nice. Hello. I realize this is sudden, but I'm Margaret. We met at the Velvet Room the other day. There is one important point I forgot to warn you about. So I thought it best to contact you immediately. The bonds created through social links are another important means of strengthening the powers of your persona. Though you may be pressed for time, devoting yourself to battles will not quench your heart's yearnings. Do not hasten heedlessly through your days. And remember the importance of moving at a sustainable pace. Please remember that. Well then, if you'll excuse me. Sorry if you can hear background noise. I'm there's someone doing something in the background. I can't really do very much about it. You took Margaret's advice to heart. You should spend you should think carefully about how you spend your days. Nice, so now I can actually go around and do the social link shit. I mean we could have done that before, but Yo. Oh, what's up? You got morning practice? Here you hear the two talking. You know what, how two guys can join the sports club starting today, right? I thought that maybe if I ran around a little, that w would be some good promotion. Dude, if you run around like that, how are you people going to know which club you're in? I didn't think about that. <laughs> that classic you. Hope our club meets some fresh blood, too. It gets everyone excited. Are you guys not going to try and get people to sign up? I don't know about that. Everyone's saying that they want a girl to be your manager, though. Oh, hey! Let's stop by the shrine in the shopping district on our way home today. Might as well pray for some newcomers. We're leaving that up to God now? Well, alright. Oh, yeah. Hear that rumor about that thing that lives in the shrine? I did. I wonder if it's true. Why am I not too cool? Classes have ended for today. You're waiting for Yukiko to recover. You recall being told that you can join a sports club. Maybe you find out. Uh, maybe you can find out how to join the faculty office. You have opportunities to meet people in town or at school. You may build social links with some of those people through your interactions with them. Time will pass as you build your social links. However, your friendship will influence the result of a fused persona. If you create a persona of the same arcana as the social link you've built, that persona is granted an experience bonus after the fusion. Seek out people whom you can build social links. So I'm guessing like Chie and Yosuke, I don't know. Oh, I took on the roof. No, a whole lot of nothing.
Yeah, this music is good. I don't know where anyone is. Uh, I was assuming that they would be hanging around at the school. I don't know where the shrine is either, even though it told me like three times. No idea. What am I talking about? I can't see them too, I, uh, I am, well, I'm daughter of the owner of the Monica Hobby Shop, er, it got closed down, so now we're in a little trouble, huh? <laughs> Listen to me. Uh, going on like this, huh? <laughs> Listen to me going on like this. If you're about to murder? So scary, I mean, wow, a real murderer. Well, uh, I guess we'll have to be uh, careful and stuff, you know? Can't you at least try to make me feel better? Like, tell me that you're protecting me or something. What? D don't be ridiculous. How am I supposed to? Well, uh, I... Well, are you going to say it or not? Come on! Uh, it does not look like it. Where will you go? Um, this is literally the hardest part about Persona, while you're waiting for the stuff to go on, um, figuring out what you're supposed to be doing, or like, we're doing, finding, like, doing the social link stuff. I mean, I like it, it's the best part of the game, I just, I don't know where anyone is right now. Welcome to the Velvet Room. Well then, I shall tell you about how I can offer you my assistance. I can gather a number of personas you possess and provide them with you the ability to fuse them. I have suggestions for my for the creation of powerful personas that may be of use to you. If you want to summon a new persona that you have not registered, please try the summon persona option. However, if you register a persona in the compendium, you'll be able to summon the persona by selecting check compendium. If you wish to know more about the Compendium, please ask Margaret. I will explain how to create Personas through Fusion. There is a variety of methods to fuse Personas together. A normal spread is a fusion of two Personas. A triangle spread is a fusion of three. There are many Persona cards that can be used as the basic for fusions and have a larger number of fusion results. The drawback is that Using multiple personas in a fusion will always result in a single persona. Do not forget this. Also, personas, also a persona created through fusion may gain additional power depending on the day it is created. Refer to the fusion forecast to ensure that fusion works what you desire. If you would like to be able to ask. Fusion forecast. Weak to fire, strong to... My greatness, I have come to serve. Right, additional power, let's go zero. Alright, people. 
uh, thank you so much for watching this Persona episode. It's going to be a lot shorter than the normal ones, but I have a lot of stuff to do today, and I really just wanted to get the boss done today. So, I hope you guys all enjoy, and I'm out. Peace.